guys, so I am coming to you with a classic Dollar Tree haul. I had a great experience in the dollar store today and I want to share it with you. Didn't plan on doing this haul, but I found some great finds in the Dollar Tree today. And let's get to it. I was only going to show you the fun things, but let's show you everything I got today. Starting with the boring things first. I got some noodles because I've been craving some ramen and I'm going to eat it today when I'm done this video while I'm editing. So you know. Um, I went in for two things. Number one was a scooper for my kitten and I did get that. Uh, I forgot, I realized I forgot one when I was buying all the kitten stuff and I was using like a cup to scoop his poop and that's wasting litter and uh, so I was like I gotta get a scoop. Whatever. So I got the scoop. I also got some other things for him. I got some toys, some little, the bowls with the bell in them. I also got some carpet refresher. Some carpet refresher and some odor neutralizer from the dollar store. I really like these. They work really, really well. Um, and this one is the no vacuum kind because ain't nobody got time for that. Uh, okay. And I also got a laser pointer. I got two because it's the dollar store and they break. So I got a little laser pointer to tire him out. Oh, and he got some Nine Lives soft treats. I don't buy pet food like you know I've had cats and everything from the dollar store unless it's like a name brand because like the generic brands tend to have a lot of salt in them and they can't be good for the cat so if there is like a name brand in there and by him being a kitten I got I only get the soft ones right now so some soft because you're a kitten right you're a kitten uh yeah so that's the cat stuff he got a little got a little but yeah other than that I found some good deals starting from when I walked in the door so they had some featured books like right in the front of the dollar store and look what book I got so this is Mally Mally's book Mally is a brand that I actually don't own anything from I'm actually not uh, it's not that I'm not a big fan, nothing really appeals to me, but she's a brand that's in Ulta. But this woman is, I really like her. Um, she's been on like Wendy and she'll do like, and she's just a really fun and happy type of person. Um, but anyway, her book is Love, Lashes, and Lipstick My Secrets for Gorgeous, Happy Life. It was in the dollar store. And I was like, okay, I don't really do like self help, like self help type of things and I was like okay is it about makeup but it is it's it's kind of like her life but then it's like tips like the 10 minute face and like mascara and all the it is makeup tips in here the perfect nude lip it is a makeup book by a makeup artist she owns her own brand and everything like that and I found this in the dollar store in the bin it was the last one love lashes and lipstick my secrets for a gorgeous happy life by Mally so beauty books for the win for the win. And then I got some, I guess, uh, cosmetic related things. Not really. Um, oh, I got some of these microfiber washcloths because I love them. I um, use them on my face specifically. I give them to the guests when they come over. Like these are just four, four dollar. And I just, I like the way the microfiber cloths feel. And so I, I picked up some more. I also picked up some toothbrushes, boring stuff I know, for traveling because I always forget mine. I always forget mine and yeah, so that's there. And I picked up some baby wipes, some Huggies. I only picked up two packs because I have a pack of baby wipes still here. But I picked up two more packs of baby wipes. Um, and then, okay, I saw these and I only saw one pack and these are for Nelson. Everyone knows Nelson is as white as a ghost. And he burns in the sun. He can reapply so he can bathe in the sunscreen. And he's still burn. He, you know, high SPF, whatever. So, I always see things to look out, help my baby out. Um, but these are Max Block After Sun Aloe Wipes. I've never seen this before. He uses aloe when he, when he burns and everything. But these are wipes. Aloe Vera White Toilettes. And I only saw one pack. And they were like in a place where I could tell they weren't supposed to be there. But I couldn't find them anywhere else. But anyway, got some aloe wipes for the boo. Hopefully they work. I don't know. I also got a cuticle nipper trimmer. This is by LA Cross, Sally Hansen. I have, I, this is my favorite cuticle trimmer. I actually was just using mine yesterday. I have another more expensive one, one that come in nail kits. This dollar one is the best cuticle trimmer nipper I have ever used. So, right? So, yeah, picked one up, picked another one up, because when they get dull, you can rip up your fingers, and you don't want to do that. Um, yeah, so, I got some razors. Now, 
<laughs> I, my argument with dollar store, people will always say, can it's dollar store razors? Like, that's the only place I find my dollar store razors. I do not grow hair on my, ha on my legs, on my arms. Never had, I never, I've never, I don't have any. I don't have any. I grew hair on my legs one time. I, I broke my patella, which is your kneecap. I know. I fell on my knee. I cracked my kneecap in half when I was nine years old. Had a cast from my thigh to my ankle for like three months. Those three months, I grew hair on that leg at nine years old. The other leg had no hair. I was in the bathtub when I got my cast off and I shaved my leg at nine years old. Figured it out. Cut myself a little bit. Hair never grew back never that's the only time I don't have hair my grandmom doesn't have hair my mom doesn't have hair we just don't we don't have it I do grow a little bit of hair on my underarms this might be TMI but I probably shave my pits like once a year <laughs> uh summertime I might do a little bit more if I'm wearing a tank top but yeah it's been like I have one deodorant it's been like it's been like four months since I shaved my butt so and it's only a little bit of hair I don't need a full fancy razor to shave like four strands these do the job and that's why and when people come over i always give them away so for some reason i didn't have any razors um <clears throat> sorry um i did find a hair product i thought this was so funny so you guys know i love gorilla snot um it, it here here's a little one the gorilla gorilla snot gel to lay my edges oh my god smooth my hair love gorilla snot I was, and this is fairly cheap. It, you can find it for like three or four dollars in the big bottle. But this is monkey gunk hair gel. And I opened it up and it looks just like Gorilla Snot. It's that gross snotty consistency. And so I'm going to give this a try um, because why not? Like it's a dollar monkey gunk. I know what they're trying to emulate. And so, well, yeah, here it is right here compared to the performance of Gorilla Snot gel. So it's right on there. It's right on there a dollar can we help you also some wipes I this is the first time I've seen these in the dollar store these are just facial wipes kind of like generic but they have they say charcoal you guys know I'm a sucker for a charcoal wipe um, I read the ingredients it's the same company that distributes all like dollar store makeup wipes which I'm also fine with to wipe off swatches and things like that uh, and these do have charcoal powder in them. I don't know if they're black though. I, I highly doubt it. Oh, they are! They're black! That makes me happy. That makes me happy. So, oh, I like black ones. So I got two, I picked up two packs of those for a dollar and you get 30 in there. Oh, it says it on the package. 30 black wipes. Candace, get yourself together. Um, then I saw these next two things. I bought a bunch of them because I was so excited. So this is some cleansing cloths. This is by the brand Swispers. So Swispers is actually sold in Walmart. They're fairly inexpensive. They make really nice uh, blending sponges like the uh, cosmetic white, um, not wipes, cosmetic like Q-tips and uh, sponges and all those type of things. Swispers makes like cotton products. There you go. Cotton products. Uh, beauty products they're in the aisle like next to the brushes and stuff the Swispers products they make like makeup sponges and things anyway 24 pack of 100% cotton cleansing cloths these are disposable washcloths smooth soft and lint free sheets of 100% cotton for cleansing and makeup removal use as a disposable washcloth with your favorite cleansers so this and I'm sure they're inexpensive in Walmart, but they're not a dollar. So they have a little thing. You open them up. I'll go ahead and open them up. Um, and I saw this. This was on the bottom. I guess this is a campaign. It's really nice. It says, Sleep Naked. Sleep Naked is a public awareness campaign encouraging daily makeup removal regi regimens for cleaner and healthier skin, which I thought was really cool. So it's a campaign they're a part of. So I'm going to open it up. I am, because I'm pull one out. Yeah, so they're thicker than tissues, but they're, oh, definitely, and they're strong, so you can wash your face with this in the morning, you can wipe everything off, and throw it away. Like, I'll put these by the sink. They're not like makeup remover wipes, they don't have soap in them, but they're used in replace of a washcloth, so you can have a clean cloth on your face every single day. So I bought five packs. <clears throat> five dollars. Five dollars, and like I said, it's 24 in each one, and that really excited me. 
And then the final thing that excited me, and you guys, everyone's going to run to your dollar store. Because people, I watch a lot of people who go do dollar store hauls and find all these amazing deals in dollar store. And I never find them. And apparently I went to my dollar store on the right day. Rustoleum never wet. Okay, let me explain what Never Wet is. Never Wet is a super hydrophobic product. A little science term. Science term. Anyway, what it is, is this two-part system. It's by rust -Oleum, same people that make all the spray paints and stuff. It's a two-part system that makes the surface waterproof. It makes it waterproof. You can spray this on. Well, this has metal, concrete, wood, um, but also great for aluminum, galvanized metal, PVC, masonry, asphalt, vinyl siding, plastic, fabric, leather, canvas, and more. And people, I see YouTube videos of this where people like spray the Never Wet system on their shoes and like squirt like chocolate sauce, and it's literally just just sliding off of the surface. Okay, and. People stand behind this never wet. And immediately, I didn't think of myself. I thought of my little brother and his million pairs of sneakers. And you know how guys are with their sneakers. I thought about him. But anyway, it's a two-part process. I looked up the price of this in the store, in the dollar store, Walmart. And Walmart's not expensive. 20 bucks at Walmart for this. For this two-part system, $20 at Walmart, $1 in the Dollar Tree. I got, I think I got six of them because I got three of them for him and three of them for me. Um, and so... And like Nelson goes hiking and fishing and things like that. It'd be, it was, they had a lot of them and I wanted to get more of them. Like Candace, calm down. So I'll see if it, if he likes it and hopefully they have more in my dollar store. But anyway, I'll read it. Nelver Wet is a super hydrophobic treatment that dramatically repels water, mud, ice, and other liquids. This revolutionary new class of coatings cause water to form nearly perfect speed spheres which roll off the surface keeping items dry and clean um and like i said i've seen videos of this it's not an exaggeration it prevents rust and everything like that so this is something you could like spray on your outdoor furniture a lot of people do spray on like the outside of their house um your your uh, decorations in your lawn people do on the wood on anything and this two part two-step process um two-step process it's in it's clear it's like frosted clear uh full cans like spray paint full cans for one dollar i just it just blew my mind it just completely blew my mind it did i had a great day at the dollar tree today <laughs> i had a great day at the dollar tree so that is my haul um and i hope you find good deals at your dollar tree so i'm going to put my things away, eat my ramen, and use my laser pointer to tire my cat out. So if you have any questions, comments, concerns about any of the products mentioned in this video, feel free to leave it down below. I love you all, and I'll talk to you guys in the next one. Bye.